think um, what they did was they listened to the fact that I really like having um, my panels hung on the wall and that I can stand or sit on the floor and paint and I like to paint on my panels um, all at the same time. Like I'll start here and then I'll go down to another piece and I'm working with, with color a lot. Um, I am going back and forth to each of the works and I paint, I think like a printmaker, I'll mix up a certain color and I'll just keep using that color till it's gone. Mm -hmm. and, and that's why I have to have a lot of surface to work on. Um, the, and the way this room was set up was that all the walls are left open so I can um, put these panels up and have this conversation with the art from here to across the room and move freely back and forth without having to set up an easel or having to stop and rearrange things. So in that way it was, um, they heard me and respected my request. You said you paint like a printmaker? Yeah. Can you explain what that means? Um, well, well, in printmaking, when you um, are going to print your block, your screen, or a lithograph off of stone, you mix up your ink, and you mix up enough ink to print your edition. And let's say I was doing an edition of, you know, 10, 15, 20. You mix up a certain amount of that color, and you use it to print that edition. And so, um, I mixed up this amount of paint and um, and I'll say, well, shoot, I want to use this color and then I see the paintings as a big addition of work and so I'll take this color and I'll put this color on everything and so it's sort of like they're all part of one family and they um, belong together and I'm responding to each of the pieces with, with this color. So. Um, instead of a screen or printing it, I'm walking to each of the pieces and sort of feeding it this color.